y'all welcome back to my channel it's your girl jubilee and if you're new here welcome today i'm taking you along with me on a travel vlog during easter weekend i went to virginia and i visited my friend kim i needed to get away i've been just in my bag in my feelings and i needed a change of scenery so she invited me down and i took her on that offer so the next morning we walked to a local spot in richmond for breakfast and i just loved the art murals along the way girl it was the black girl brown skin melanin popping for me we went to brewer's cafe which is black owned and has a live dj all day in the cafe uh, we had latte i had chai which is my favorite and i had bacon and egg on a croissant with some potatoes on the side, which was really yummy. Then we headed to Maymount Park, which has mansions, gardens, wildlife, even an aquarium on its grounds. And it was really a sight to see, there was so much. And again, it was Easter weekend, so everybody in their mom was out with the kids, literally. There was activities for families and there was food trucks. We stopped and we got some funnel cake. So if you haven't already noticed, this vlog is very voiceover heavy. I'm trying to get used to vlogging in public and also with others. You don't just want to stick a camera in someone's face like, and also knowing when to be present and when to have the camera out. So we got our tools done in preparation for church. We then headed to Target where I picked up some new flavors of Celsius that I haven't tried. If you follow me on Instagram, you know these are my jam. I love drinking these when I work out in the gym. They give me the added push that I need to get through my workout. I've been in the gym working out consistently and even being on this little getaway, it was no excuse for me to get up and get my body moving. My friend, she had a gym right in her apartment complex, so I was able to get up and get my workout in. One of my goals is to be a healthier me, so we crushing goals, baby. actually my first Easter weekend away from home and family and I didn't even mind my friend I consider her family she's my sis and she was so gracious and so hospitable she prepared Easter Sunday dinner for her and I and it was just perfect she's an island gal so we had all the island things and it was so good there was a grill on her rooftop and we threw that jerk chicken up on that thing and We played some Uno while the food was on the grill and you know Uno and black people and how everybody has their own rules. Well, we had to figure that out because no, <laughs> I only believe in number sexies. That is the only way I play. Pick up two more, you know. Pick up four. Pick up six. Out. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, you win, baby. Okay, that's one. I don't have to shuffle no more. I don't have to shuffle no more. <laughs> I had a good streak going, y'all, and she finally got one on me. But let's get into this shrimp. I'm trying to tell y'all, this food was good. So we had jerk chicken, grilled shrimp, rice and peas, cabbage, and cornbread. And that cornbread, baby girl, <laughs> was so fire.
Green. Oh wait! Get yeah, wait! <laughs> I picked the color. I know, I know, I know, I know. I know. <laughs> I told y'all, Uno gets real, y'all. <laughs> but this is my nephew, Pup, Pancho. He was dancing with me, and as soon as I pulled the camera out, he wanted to stop. That's that's how they be. No. No. We went out one night on a night scene, and that was quite the experience. Um, I didn't vlog that. So for my last night there, Kim, she wanted to take me to another one of her favorite spots, which is Wood and Iron. And this is my kind of place. I got the game day combo, which is a burger and a side of wings. A side of wings, y'all. <laughs> I had the best time on this trip, just getting a fresh breath of air and seeing my friend. Since she moved to Virginia, I don't get to see her often, so it was great. But now back to Philly. So I'm here shopping in Joann's for some props that I need for a product photography shoot. I was able to turn a gifting collaboration from a brand into a product photography paid partnership. Shout out to me. So it was very last minute. So I had to hurry up and grab some things that I needed um, specifically for a summer beach type photo. While I was here, I decided to look at the fabric. I like to incorporate fabric sometimes in my flat lays for products um, or use for backdrops when I'm taking pictures for myself. So I wanted to see what they had and I picked up two different ones that I found. So then I ran over to Walmart. I wanted to shoot this outside in natural sunlight. So I wanted to get a folding table that I could set up in the back of my apartment. Then somehow I ended up in Target in the home section. I don't know, but I was here looking for an acrylic tray, which I found. I didn't end up using, but I can save this for next time. Okay, so I'm shooting outside and I have this little makeshift setup. I got this table, fold, folding table from Walmart. Shooting with my big boy camera today. Just here's some behind the scenes footage of the shoot that I'm doing and I'm just obsessed with the setup. Got my phone holding these leaves. Thanks so much for watching. Let me know if you like this style vlog and be sure to subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you in my next video.